Welcome back to Perks Recap. It is the Rolling Stones. I just want to make love to you. This is once again Steve Hannum's doing his chronological order. This is another one from him uh, giving us a kind of like a history lesson as we go along here. This is from 1964 or 65. He wasn't quite sure. The uh, audio quality, the, the video quality, I would say is kind of iffy, but it's not too, too bad. You can definitely make it out. It's, it's, it, you'll see. <laughs> anyway, please make sure you like, comment, subscribe, hit the notification bell. Here we go. This one's good, I just want to make love to you. I don't want you be no slave. I don't want you work all day. I don't want your money too. I just want to make love to you, baby. Love to you, baby. Love to you, baby. Love to you. I don't want you wash my clothes. I don't want you keep my home. I don't want you cause I'm tired of you. I just want to make love to you, baby. Love to you, baby. Love to you, baby. Love to you, baby. my clothes. I don't want you keep my home. I don't want you cause I'm sort of blue. I just want to make love to you, baby. Love to you, baby. Sweet love to you, baby. Love to you. Hey! my bread. I don't want you make my bed. I don't want your money too. I just want to make love to you, Bill. Love to you, Bill. Sweet love to you, Bill. Love to you, Bill. Love to you. I just want to make love to you. There you have it. That is the Rolling Stones with I Just Want to Make Love to You. I need to thank Steve Hannum. Of course, of course, he is doing this chronological order for us. He's taking us on this journey. He started in the 60s with a band called The Shadows, who I never heard of. Now we're in the mid-60s. And it's another one of these, um, it's the Rolling Stones, and obviously I know them. Um, it's another one of these, uh, the, the blues are take, starting to take hold and get attention from these rock bands. And this is another original blues song written by Willie Dixon, originally recorded by Muddy Waters. I think there might be an Etta James version of this song as well, because that came up when I was doing a search for it. Um, anyway, I enjoyed the song. I was a little concerned about the quality at the beginning because I, I played it a little bit right before I started recording and I wasn't, I was a little sketchy on the quality, a lot of interference at the beginning it seemed like, but once they got going it wasn't too bad and it wasn't too hard to overlook that and yeah, I enjoyed the song for what it was. It was quick, another one of these two and a half minute songs, they go by really fast, I didn't even pause during it, never really had a chance to, but I liked that, like the harmonica in there, of course Mick and, and Keith and everybody, pretty cool, pretty cool seeing them so young. Uh, hopefully we'll, we'll, we'll continue on with this. Uh, Steve did mention that he's got a part three coming for this chronological order that we're doing. We're also got a Gary Moore, a uh, couple videos coming your way. Uh, people write, 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 wrote songs about Gary Moore after he passed away. The anniversary of that is coming up February 6th. So we're going to have a Gary Moore video on February 6th for sure. But yeah, hopefully you tune in for all that. Hopefully you enjoyed this one. Until next time, I will see you later.